Hi there, I'm Claire and welcome to my series of Go Green for 2015. This week I'm going to be showing you how you can upcycle some old clothes into some new clobber for your children. So let's get started. So I have this old pair of lounge pants that I don't want anymore and actually they're kind of a bit knackered. So I'm going to turn them into a new pair of lounge trousers for my son. So first thing I'm going to do is turn these inside out. This is a really, really quick upcycle, so there's not going to be too much kind of measuring and folding. So I'm just going to fold them in half and then lay them flat. Okay, so we are nearly flat. There we go. So what I'm going to do, I've got these pinking scissors which make zigzags, which means it doesn't fray. And I'm going to cut roughly about my son's leg length and then I'm also going to chop off the waistband at the top. Okay. What I'm going to do is on the outside of the leg as well, I'm going to cut it all the way down. So opening it out, you can see I've kind of got a trouser shape going on here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pin all the way down the outside and then I'm going to pop it on the sewing machine. Okay, so last pin in and then go and sew. So I'm going to sew exactly where I've pinned, either side of the leg, not the waist, and not the ankles. Okay, and all we need to do is repeat on the other side, and then we are good to carry on. So I'm just going to make little turn-ups on the bottom of the leg, just to make little seams. And then I'm just going to stitch all the way around, and repeat on the other leg. So, that is the legs both taken up and pinned, so we're back on the sewing machine sew those up. Okay, and repeat on the other leg. The last bit we need to do before we tidy the whole thing up and get rid of all the threads is just to create the waistband. So again, I'm just going to fold it over once and I'm really sorry, Mum. Just once. And I need to make enough gaps. So here's my elastic. So what you need to do is when you're folding over the top, you just need to make sure that it's actually going to be wider than the elastic that you've got. But you don't want it too wide because you don't want the elastic to turn around once it's inside. So, what I'm going to do, so I'm going to pin around the outside and then I'm going to sew it, but I'm going to leave a gap about this big and that's where I can thread through the elastic. So, you want to take a piece of elastic, a large safety pin, and you just want to attach it to the top of the elastic. Now, through the gap that you left, the hole, can you see? You just want to post through the safety pin that has the elastic attached to it and feed it all the way around. Now we've got the waistband out. What I'm going to do is I'm going to sew those two together and we're going to hide it inside. Okay, so now all we've got to do is just kind of keep wriggling it, getting all the elastic inside. So all I'm going to do now is I'm going to go around, just kind of take off all these nasty little loose threads, turn it inside out, and we're finished. See, and there we have it, some absolutely gorgeous lounge pants for a child. So thank you so much for watching. That's the end of this series. If you like this video, don't forget to click the like button and you can also subscribe to our channel. You can like us on Facebook and you can also follow us on Twitter. I'll see you soon. Take care.